hello everyone in this video i will show you how to write a jsp page which will send a cookie to client cookie actually used for session handling cookie is a textual information which is created by server stored in a client browser so here we will write a simple jsp page So here we will include our code which will create a cookie and which will send this cookie to client. So if you want to include any code in HTML page, we need to use these tags. So in order to create a cookie, we need to create a object of cookie class. And this uh, constructor of this class is having two parameters of a string type. First parameter will be considered name of cookie and second one will be considered value of that cookie so let's say i am creating a cookie with uh, user and value you can give any value so we have created a cookie name of this cookie is user and value this one now we need to send this cookie to client uh, in gsp there are implicit objects which are already available so we don't need to create those objects like uh, if you want to write something to a client we directly can use out object so same way we are having request and response parameters available so here we will use response parameter and we will use the method add cookie and then we will so uh, this JSP page what this page is doing okay let's print something here uh, cookie example so what this page will do uh, on execution of this page this page will create a cookie and this cookie will be sent to client and clients browser will store that cookie so next time when we execute same gsp again that browser will attach a stored cookie with request so i have saved this file on desktop then uh, let me place this file on tomcat web app directory so I will go to C program files Apache software Tomcat web apps and let's say I'm putting in demo. Okay, so I have placed this file in a Tomcat directory. Now I need to start my web server. So here oh, okay, this is green, so it means our web server is running and let's check whether server is running or not so you can check by writing localhost and port number so our web server is running now i need to access uh, that page now one more thing you need to remember regarding jsp in jsp jsp actually by default create a session object which can be used to track session so if we don't want that thing because what that uh, mechanism will do whenever we execute any JSP page that page by default will create a session object and a cookie will be created with name J session ID so here when we execute our JSP one cookie which is created by default for every JSP page which is also uh, having name J session ID and one cookie we are creating so finally this page is sending two cookies but let's say we don't want that feature we don't want that cookie so what we need to do we will use a page directory and we will write here false so this line will specify that don't create that default session object which result in creating a j session id cookie so i have i need to copy it again demo replace so now I need to run my JSP program. So name of my directory is demo and name of my file our file name is cookie. So here we will write cookie.jsp. Okay, so we have sent a request to JSP. This JSP has sent a cookie to this client browser. 
so we want to see whether any cookie came to this browser or not so you can see uh, so my browser is firefox go to your option privacy remove individual cookie and just search for localhost so if you can see uh, there is one cookie found name of this cookie is user and value whatever value we have is specified so finally this cookie is stored on our browser and when we run this jsp again next time so every time we run this jsp page that cookie will be attached with our request so this is a very simple example to send a cookie in jsp page thanks for watching